Hello, I am Sarah Langa. Join me as I take you through my style journey and look back at some of the most iconic looks that have helped shape me and the garments that tell you who I am. I grew up in a family of designers. My grandmother was a dressmaker and designer, and my mother used to do all of her beading. So just growing up in that environment where there's like meters of fabric around you and beads and all of these cool accessories and just being able as a child to play around with that, it really helped shape who I am and it also helped me find my passion in fashion. That outfit is actually from my most recent campaign with Scotch and Soda. Scotch and Soda was my very very first brand that I worked with as an influencer. It's a two-piece that um, I styled as a dress and I just wanted to go for like a more conservative look. It's literally like gold dripping on my skin. That's how beautiful the garment is. I feel like I've transitioned into like a more business sophisticated woman and that was kind of the look that made me feel very confident and it was just like it was so fun. The evolution of my style is definitely inspired by me. I have changed myself so many times and just being able to start off as this young girl who was very vibrant and very like into like fashion trends and, and now turning into more of like a businesswoman who wants to look at the bigger picture. I'm more focused on aligning myself with brands that are that have sustainability conversations and wear outfits that you know I can wear for longer. I got contacted by a international brand and they wanted me to be a part of a sustainability campaign for a capsule range which was made by recycled fabrics and I got styled by one of my best friends Rich Nisi and he's always pushing the boundaries. He was like look today we are putting two dresses on you. We were inspired by Kim Kardashian's Balenciaga collection where she was basically covered in like pink fabric from like her toe to her finger and we tried to recreate that moment but in a more sustainable way. So who says you can only wear a wedding dress once, right? Let me tell you something. That look trended on Twitter for three days. I think it's probably the most spoken about outfit that I've ever worn in my entire history of being an influencer. The truth is, I didn't want to go to the event. I wasn't feeling my best. And Rich came to my house because he didn't have a plus one and he forced me. He was like, you are going to this event. I don't care what excuse you're coming up with. If you don't have an outfit, we will find something. So my hair was not ready. I didn't have a makeup artist. So I basically had to like do my makeup quickly in like 20 minutes. We basically came up with this, you know, masterpiece <laughs> of like a combination of different things I had in my closet. We really had Virgil on our mind and we wanted to recreate a Virgil moment. And it was such a big risk for me because no one had ever worn a cap with a glamorous dress on a red carpet event. Two weeks later, the Met Gala happened. Nicki Minaj was on the, on the Met Gala carpet with a cap. Kylie Jenner was on the red carpet with a cap. It was really one of those moments where, you know, you kind of realize that in the darkest times, sometimes you can really push yourself together and create some of the most iconic, celebrated moments. I put a white look together so quickly. If you're gonna give me five minutes to get dressed, it's gonna be in a white outfit. And just being able to preserve my white clothing for a long time. And Skip has really helped me do that. Skip's technology for the perfect white range has helped me really keep my whites new for longer. By protecting your clothes, you're preserving your individuality. We all want our clothes to feel soft and comfortable. But what can we do to make sure that our garments look new for longer? Well, worry no more. I'm Lesejo Kosmilao, your Skip Hybrid Stylist. And I'm here to share my tips on how to keep your clothes new for longer. Tip one, protect your delicates. Garments made from finer textures like silk, chiffon, or linen must always be washed separately. Just place them into a pillowcase before you put them in the machine. Tip two, choose the right detergent, like Skip. Some washing detergents tend to be quite harsh for this kind of fabrics. Tip three, 
choose the right fabric softener a good fabric conditioner gives your garment a softer touch tip four don't hang your clothes out to dry for longer than necessary i recommend that you hang your clothes inside out in that way you actually are preventing the sun from stealing your beautiful colors from your garments there you have it guys my top tips for keeping your clothes looking new for longer now i want to get sarah into our skip walking closet and see what we can do with those garments that she had forgotten about and make them new for longer sarah welcome to our skip walking closet how are you i'm good i'm yes. so excited always, always good to see you this specific look right i remember this on on, on the grams because yes. obviously i've double tapped it so this was for a scotch and soda campaign yeah. their latest w autumn winter campaign mm. and i loved it because it says glam sophisticated i'm a working girl i sign a billion dollar contracts but excuse I us also fashion, <laughs> you know so let's say what i've been yeah. struggling to rewear this outfit to be honest i haven't worn it since i posted it on instagram I bought it as a two-piece and I find that I'm starting to do that a lot. Yeah. I wear outfits as I buy them and I really struggle to restyle them. I mean, I have so many things in my closet, yeah. but just putting looks together is always just such a t challenge. Listen, I get that a lot actually. A lot of my clients find themselves recycling a lot of, a lot of their clothes. Yeah. About 20% of their wardrobe, 80% of the time is what yeah. they wear, right? So we're going to have a look now and see what we can actually do just to refresh this and still keep it you know just still keep the look going but the simplicity of it the classic yeah. look that you were going for let's see what we can find the wardrobe yeah cool, cool. let's do it hmm. oh wait i think we found it yes i think this will work i think i like the idea of something solid okay with the metallic and patterns on the skirt yes let's maybe just try it on the mannequin and see how that translates before i put it on you what i love about this blouse yep. is it's a blouse Everyone has a cream blouse in their wardrobe. 100%. For me, my cream blouse is a part of the 80% of the closet that I don't use. Yeah. So most of the time I find myself shopping for essentials and it will always be that really cute cream blouse, but then I kind of like pack it at the back of my closet and forget about it. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, I, I, do, mean, I do like I do like the color story. What do you think? I think if we just put this up, make it a high waist. Yeah. And maybe just cinch it a little bit at the back. Yes. I think that will be in great shape to your beautiful body in this outfit. I love that. Should we maybe try it on you yeah. and see what that looks it. like? Cool. So how's it looking, sir? And I'm ready. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Mm. Great balance. Ooh. So I've picked Ooh, some accessories. Nice. However, I do feel like, because I would have loved this to be like a high waist, yeah. but you can't seem to find your waist. Therefore, <laughs> <laughs> we will cinch it a little bit. Let me see. Okay. Yeah. Ooh, I think that brings a little bit more. Like, I like the fit of that. I love it. I love the one shoulder situation. It still brings the glam element to it. Yeah. And to be honest, I, do, I don't think I actually appreciated the skirt up until this <laughs> Yeah, I do like this skirt. I think you can do a lot with it. There's yeah. a lot you can do with it even in winter. And I've picked up these accessories for you, actually. Let me know what you think. I do feel this um, gold earpiece will just finish off the look quite nicely. Ooh, I love that brings a bit of an edge to it as well, yeah. right? Yeah. And if we just do that and give you one of these as well for your fingers, I love this ring. I think this Stunning. ring brings a balance. I feel like I'm proposing. <laughs> <laughs> I think this ring brings a yes. balance between I say yes. <laughs> well, so where are we celebrating our engagement party? Oh. <laughs> our engagement, rather. Well, we have to go somewhere super special because I look good. You do. <laughs> you do look good. I'm happy you like this. Great. And that's how you keep your outfit new for longer. <laughs>